I know you must go, but don't look at the clock. Don't hear the TikTok. Composure and discipline were the hallmarks of Barbados's first lady of song, Carlin Leacock. And the eulogist Jessica Odell told the packed congregation in the Garfield Sobers Gymnasium that included Prime Minister Mia Amor Motley, other government members and cultural icons, the late singer has left an indelible mark on the Barbados and Caribbean landscape through a life of service and commitment. In the face of challenge, she stayed the course with that wide, warm smile which never left her, even when she was breaking inside. Excellence is another. This was her hallmark, and she pushed herself really hard, whether it was in the community, parish ambassadors, on the stage, even in family. She pushed herself to be that excellent person. Daughters Jan and Debbie, in their tribute, times punctuated with applause and laughter, recalled elements of their childhood with their mother. Mom rededicated her life to the Lord in her 50s, and a new spark was ignited in her. She carried this same passion in her Christian walk and took pleasure in using her wealth of experience and talent for the kingdom of God. She absolutely loved working with churches on productions, training workshops and worship teams and choirs and building wonderful relationships with the young and the young at heart in Barbados and abroad. She wasn't slowing down, not at all. The Deliverance Temple House of Prayer cherished her constant contact and consultation. The body of Barbados' First Lady of Song, Carlin Leacock, was laid to rest today. May she rest in peace. Trevor Thorpe, CBC News.